one of the benefits of the anointing of the Spirit of God upon a person is divine protection. We see in the book of uh, first in the book of Psalms 105, from 14 to 15, Psalm 105, it says that God suffered the kings not to touch the Israelites. And he said, Do not touch my anointed ones, and do my prophets no harm. People of God, when you are anointed, you are guaranteed divine protection from God. Anyone that harms you or tries to harm you receives a devastating catastrophe from the Almighty God. It's in the Bible. This is not me saying it. God's word says it. Even King David, when he even attacked King Saul in the book of uh, 1 Samuel chapter 24, he said, how dare I touch the anointed of God? He refused to touch King Saul even because even though King Saul was looking for him to kill him. He said, no, I'm not going to touch Saul because he's anointed. So he understood the principle of the anointing. When you are anointed of God, as children of the New Testament, anyone that tries to harm you receives a big punch from the Almighty God. That's why we go around preaching the gospel anywhere. We minister to people. We cast out devils. We rebuke the enemy from the communities in the name of Jesus. And God Almighty, He protects us from this evil and things around the world. So we should strive for the anointing of God, you know. Let's aspire to receive this beautiful unction of the Holy Spirit in our lives. And the Lord will continue to bless you in the name of Jesus. God bless you and I'll talk to you again.